everybody. Ricky here with Apple Valley Farm. Wanted to bring you along with me on the ride today. So I'm still working on this little console table that I posted yesterday on Facebook. And um, anyway, wanted to let you know about some of the, the challenges that we're having. That's another way of saying we're having problems with it. <laughs> anyway, it's a little out of square, so let me show you what I'm talking about. It's an easy fix, but I'm going to show you. All right, so here's our uh, little console table, and I'm very proud of it. I love the way it's looking. The biggest problem is, so let, me, let me show you here. So this thing needs to be square, obviously. So here we are, square up against this edge. Uh-oh, look at that. It's already made Look at that gap right there, and that's just in 12 inches. So we got to fix it. So I want, to, I want to turn my saw to a 45 degree angle and I just want to make a little, make a little cut here. All right, so now each one of these guys will go in a corner and since these are square, since they're square here, then they'll help square the corners up. So, in theory, right? All right, so we've got our one hole here. Now, I drilled it up three quarters of an inch from this edge, and that way, when I drill down through here, this is gonna be a little less than one inch going straight down. And I'm gonna use one inch screws to put this thing together. I wanna drill a hole, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna use a countersink bit around it to help widen it out just a little bit so it'll seat down in there. Oh my goodness. All right, so I'm getting ready to put this on here and I realize I've done my countersink holes on the back side of this. That was so dumb. Uh, well, we're gonna roll with it. We're just gonna roll. All right, so I've got, this is the redneck way to do this. I've got the corner of the table up against the wall. Now, I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do bring this thing into square. Since I'm by myself, I don't really have clamps or anything like that. This corner has got to go in just a little. So I'm gonna give it a push and when I do, watch, see if you can see if you can see this. When I give it a push, watch that crack. Hopefully it will go away. Whoop, look at that. Tell you, that's ingenious right there. That's the ingenuity that built America. All right, let's get it. Going. All right, now to further complicate things, I see my drill won't go in here because it's there's not enough room. That, oh my goodness! So. We'll have to do it by hand. We'll get a little Phillips bit. We'll get my socket set. And we're gonna put this sucker in by hand, I hope. Alrighty. And so just in case there's any doubt, I've got first two corners in down here. These two corners, no, not yet. But let's just check and see if everything's coming into square. Absolutely perfect. That is perfect. So guys, that's it, right? Pretty easy. Was that cool? It was all cattywampus and we brought it back into square with just a few little wooden blocks. So anyway, Easy done, and I hope you learned something from it. Hey, I learned something from it. This was just Han Solo, man. I'm just making this stuff up as I go. So 
we figured it out and it worked. Now, from here, now we gotta level this thing off, then we'll put the top and the shelf on it and it'll be ready to go. Cannot wait. Thanks guys for hanging out. Y'all have a good day and um, I'll talk to you later. Go make some.